What's up, family? It's Chris, and you're watching Bad Outside TV, guys. And I'm back at it again with another request. This one came from Maria Chavez. Said, "Please react to Conan Hunt for his assistance mug." I think they said this one was hilarious, or something like that. But guys, we're just gonna get right into the video. But before we do, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Comment down below what you guys like to see next. Hit that notification bell to get notification when we upload and subscribe to join the family. Now let's get into the video. You know, I'm not just the host of Conan. I'm also the spiritual leader for over 3,000 Conan staff members. It's come to my attention that someone on staff who's very close to me uh, had something valuable go missing, possibly even stolen. It's my job to solve this mystery as quickly as possible. Let's go. Conan's a complete mess, so I already know this video is going to be a mess, just like him. He's going to be doing the most. Watch. It's chicken. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm obsessed and you're my assistant, are you not? Yes, I am. How long have you worked for me? <laughs> a little over four and a half years. Okay, quick question. Did you send this email out to the entire staff? I know this is a complete abuse of hey, everybody, but if you stole my gigolos mug, I'm going to find you and destroy you. Did you send that? Uh, yes, I did. A lot to talk about. First of all, what's a gigolos <laughs> mug? Uh, Gigolos is a show on Showtime that follows Gigolos in Las Vegas. Real Gigolos? Yes, real Gigolos. And then my friend Megan gave me the mug as a gift. And it says Gigolos on one side and on the other it says Working Stiff. Is Working Stiff like a joke? Yes, I what's think the, so. What's the joke? <laughs> like, like a, like it's a stiff, like Working Stiff. Like a penis is stiff? Alright, stop. <laughs> uh, you like the occasional drink, yes? Okay. That, no, it, that is completely, completely is irrelevant. First of all, look at this little thing in the back. That's supposed to be Conan. <laughs> I just saw that. That's funny. Possible you had a little drinky winky and maybe misplaced it. I had a drinky like this morning? I had a drinky winky? No, like yesterday, late in the day. It's like three different dolls as him too. I wonder if they're gonna find this little mug because she takes out of everybody and nobody said nothing. Hey, maybe. Do you ever drink at work? <laughs> okay, let's leave it alone. Let's just leave it alone. What's this? Can you drink out of this? That's fun. That's I do okay. drink out of that. What is that? A cool logo of something? It's an astronaut with a boombox. Okay. <laughs> You're in charge of my life, right? Yes, I am, actually. <laughs> Lindsay, are you aware that Sona's Gigolo's mug is missing? Yes. Who do, you, do you have any theories about what happened to the mug? People just take shit all the time. What do you mean? Dang. She just got straight to it. Language and all. Maybe somebody <clears throat> took some of her stuff, too, because she... Said it like she has some strong anger. People just take stuff all the time. Like, calm down, first of all, and tell me what happened. That stuff stolen? Yeah. What's been stolen of yours? Well, tell yeah, I told y'all she had something stolen the way she was talking. Wait, I'm concerned. I'm not just the host of the show, I'm also a. I made a mark to prove if someone was stealing my booze. And then someone stole my booze. What kind of office is this? <laughs> So they went all the way in her little drawer or whatever she gave it. Just to get some when they could have just asked. <laughs> downtime. <laughs> downtime? You have downtime and you take a bot? This is what detectives in the 20s did. Uh, Sona's missing a mug uh, that promotes a show with male pornography. <laughs> I want to find it because I'm not just the host. I'm also sort of the spiritual leader for our staff of... That's not like... 4,000, how many people do we have on staff? It's 185, I think. <laughs> okay. I think, I think with crew. I mean, I don't know if that, I think that's so, when people ask for, I, I thought it was in the thousands. But, <laughs> we can go with that then. Bro, he, he better go to Jordan and be messing with Jordan. Jordan gonna be, what if Jordan took it? Cause you know, he always messing with um coffees and whatnot. What if Jordan took it? No, you just. Sorry. Ship has sailed. Sorry. 
Oh, is anything missing of yours? Is anything gone missing? You know what? Not in a, in a long time, but um, a few years ago, someone stole my really nice headphones right off my desk. Uh, I'll pay for it. How much? Really <laughs> so basically, you just can't have nothing. Somebody stole that girl uh, alcohol. Somebody stole her little headphones off her desk. Like, was it that really serious for headphones? Could the winter store and got it. No, seriously, how much were they worth? Just give me a just give me a ballpark figure and I'll pay for it. How much? Like five hundred dollars. Oh, that's way too much. I didn't think it was gonna be like forty dollars. I won't pay you for that. Go for it, no, I don't have that kind of money. What's your name? Don't be trying to offer to pay people stuff that you don't even know the price. He probably thought she had some little twenty dollar headphones. <laughs> John, please. Excuse me, Kramer. How dare you? I'm trying to conduct an investigation here. Hang up the, hang up the phone! I see you have some fried chicken. Of course. Is that Kentucky fried chicken? It is. I think it's the best chicken there is. <laughs> some money now. Lindsay says that. I beg to differ. They're not the best. Alcohol was taken from her desk. Do you keep alcohol on your desk? No. I should, though, probably. No, why should you? <laughs> That'll make the day more fun. Okay. Did you take her alcohol now? Oh, because I'm Irish? Yeah. <laughs> no, I didn't take her alcohol. I, I'm not a big drinker. <laughs> oh, see, Conan, you played yourself. Now nah, you got a little video of you acting crazy. Y'all, I asked this in the other video, I don't think nobody answered. Really, what does he do on his show? Because I've never seen it. Like, every time y'all show me, he messing around with his employees, bothering them. Like, he ain't got nothing to do with himself. Chicken, by the way. It's pretty good. I love Kentucky Fried Chicken. Finest chicken made. <laughs> Girl's dead. What the hell was that? You <laughs> can't get money. My colonel's dead. What's your problem? What is wrong with everybody on the staff? Did you take it? I did not. You were a liar. I'm not a liar. You took the mug. Did not take the mug. Took the mug. Why would I take the mug? Why did you take the mug? Did not do it. Okay, tell me you did it and I won't fire you. Didn't do it. Okay. All right, so you gotta stick to your story. I'm gonna stick to my story. You did it. You took it. I did not. Why are you so What did you want to jiggle that mug for? Freak, pervert. You're insane. Would you stuff it down your pants? What'd you say to me? I'm insane. insane. What kind of place is this? I'm the spiritual leader of over 10,000 staff members here in town. Yeah, he's going to go with these numbers, and the lady already told him a lot about this place. Okay, this is big. We just got a crack in the case. Uh, we believe that a staff member named RJ, RJ may have the mug. Where's RJ work? Where, what building is that? Building 44. This is the most I've walked in Los Angeles in three years. <laughs> Stay calm, everyone. It's going to be fine. RJ, how's it going? Good to see you. Good to see you. We are looking for a mug, a gigolo's mug. Yeah. I think it's right here. Why do you have this mug? Ooh. RJ actually do got it. Oh, somebody done ratted him out. Now I want to hear his story, what business he got with it. An intern brought it over. This is incredible. So you're clearly innocent. This isn't your fault. Yeah. An intern brought it to you. Correct. And now it's my job to see that an unpaid intern is fired. <laughs> RJ, thank you. Let's hug it out. Let's get in here. Let's just hold each other for a while. <laughs> My eyes are closed. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, come on. That's nice. RJ, he said an intern brought it over. How would an intern, why would an intern take a mug off your desk? It's in the cabinet, in the kitchen. Wait, you left this in the cabinet in the kitchen? Yeah. And then you're wondering why it was missing? Come on, Zoe, you expecting nobody to use it like they're supposed to know it was yours? Girl, bye. Yes. You made it sound like it was stolen off your desk. No, no, no. Thank you for finding me. Oh, thank you! That took what? How, many, how long did that take? I, I returned the mug, I spent an hour of my day finding it, and it took how long to get a thank you? Put a timer on that and just show it at the bottom right now. Yeah, that's how long it took. Little thank yous go a long way. You're welcome. It would be better than what you just did. That's why I don't say thank you to you ever, is because that's what you do. Do you, do you see? I don't say thank you because then you're like, oh, so does it thank you. What an exciting moment in life this is. 
Yeah. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible. Okay, yeah. I'm taking this. I actually work on the show. Alcoholics. All right, well, this is the end of the video, guys. If you would like to see the original video by yourself, the link will be down in the description below. And so is my social media. Add me, follow me. You guys should already know the deal. But since this is the end of the video, guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Comment down below what you guys like to see next. Hit that notification bell, get notification when we upload. And subscribe to join the family. See you guys in the next video.